All right, hello everybody. Welcome back to the channel. I know it's been a while since I've actually sat in this Funko room because I've only been in Studio B where I've been working hard on the Godzilla and Kong stuff. And of course, most of it was through the Playmates and Jada Toys figures. Today, I got something new for this movie. Of course, I'm still making videos on this movie and you probably know what it is. I mean, you saw the title. Today, we are looking at the Funko Pops. We have finally gotten the Funko Pops for this movie. It is, majority is here. I would say that right now, I don't have everything. And of course, today's video is just the unboxing bit. So today we'll just be unboxing all the Pops from the shipping boxes that they've arrived in. And then next time I'll do another video or a more solely focused review on the Pops as a whole. Now, if you didn't know, my Godzilla vs. Kong Funko Pop review video is my highest viewed Funko Pop video ever. It has 40,000 views. So hopefully I can achieve that again with these Funko Pops. I guess that remains to be seen. All right, let's start with something small from the good old eBay because this pop is an exclusive and it'll be very difficult for me to acquire it here in Canada. So I had to resort to eBay to get it. Now I'll say this right now as I just said a couple seconds ago, I don't have everything. I am missing three pops. There's three pops that I'm missing from this video that will probably come in the next few weeks, not now. So I'll probably make like this video, maybe one more unboxing video after, we'll see. So our first one here is an exclusive, but can you guess which one it is? Let me show you. <laughs> All right, interesting packing of choice. This is my very first pop of Godzilla and Kong the New Empire. This is Kong with the Beast Glove and his Battle Axe. That is our first pop, the Target Con exclusive Kong. Right, now for the big bunch here. Ah, yeah. Been a while since I got one of these big packages that has Funko Pops. The last time I got something this big was for the Playmates figures. Okay, this looks good. Looks like they've individually packaged everything. All right, everything's been taken out. I have a whole pile of cardboard boxes here, and that's good. Although I do notice some of them have folds and creases. That's not a good thing. I, I do hope these boxes actually do their job and not damage any of the pops. Let's get the big ones over with first. So, here they are. These are, I believe, six inch pops. I sure hope they are. All right. Here it is. Pop number one of Godzilla X Kong Zenyut Empire is a six inch Kong. So our first one here, of course, we got Big Kong here with the Infinity Gauntlet. I mean, sorry, the Beast Glove. Very, very nice. Obviously, I think this is just a scaled up version of the regular one. If you got bigger space, you want a bigger boy, there you go. We got Big Kong right here. So, of course, the next one here is going to be Big Godzilla, the 6-inch Godzilla. Alright, the 6-inch Godzilla. Very, very nice. Now, I'm not sure if this Godzilla will be the same as the regular one that has the heat ray, because this one does not have the heat ray. I'm not sure. I do think it's a little... I think it's the same mold. It just doesn't include the heat ray. Alright, so with the big boys aside, let's open the common pops. I can tell you right now, these are all commons. Obviously, my exclusive Kongs right there. I'm missing the Godzilla, so you can do the math. Now, the other one that I'm missing is Scar King on the Throne. I don't think that one's even released yet. It's a Funko Shop exclusive. It's also a six inch. For now, we have the common ones. So which one shall we open first? I'm gonna say let's get Kong out first. So this is the common Kong. Now, if you wanna see a real difference between him and the target Kong, of course, I will do this comparison in the review, but it is a different pop. It's not a remold. This is, of course, the smaller version of the, the six inch one. It's just an upscale, as you can see. But of course, me being me, I gotta get them all. Who do we wanna look at first? Let's actually look at Scar King first. I'm very curious because everyone says he looks like Kratos. So I wanna see this in person if he does actually look like Kratos. Yeah, I can kinda see it. Now, obviously if you haven't played God of War, you'll be like, who am I talking about? But I'm pretty sure a lot of people are familiar with Kratos and look at the Scar King pop. He kinda does. I can see the resemblance. Obviously he's missing the axe and all that. We got the main monkey, the evil monkey. Now we got the mini monkey, Suko. Okay, here is Suko. Now, 
I understand Suko is supposed to be the cute small character here, kind of like the baby Yoda of this movie, but they made him a regular sized pop. I was kind of expecting him to do what they do with baby Yoda and tilt the box like this sideways and to have him a much smaller mold there. But I think this is better. It is the same price after all for all, for all the commons. So technically speaking, this is still 15 Canadian dollars. So I'll take a bigger size if I'm paying that price. So not complaining. It's just not scale accurate, that's for sure. I did also get the pocket pops right here. Our first one here is Gojira. Godzilla himself. That is Kong. So we got our pocket pops here. Kong and Godzilla. Very, very nice. I am very curious to check out Shimo for myself here. Shimo has definitely been a worst kept secret for Legendary, and I feel like they've struggled to keep it under wraps more than Mecha Godzilla. I honestly think Shimo is like, everyone knows who she is at this point, just reveal her. She's in the second trailer anyways. <laughs> that looks Awesome! Does it come with the Frostbite? Yes, it does come with her Frostbite Blast. I will say, seeing it in person now, I, I, she is a lot smaller. I was kind of expecting it to be a lot bigger. Glad I finally can see this pop in person. I have been anticipating this one the most. And so now that truly concludes my first order of the Godzilla X Kong The New Empire Funko Pops. Which, I'm not gonna lie, I got the bulk of it, so it should be an easy ride from here. So we got our commons here. There's Shimo, Scar King, Kong, Suka right here. We got our Target Con exclusive Kong. So the roster is looking good. And of course, I got the big ones, the Godzilla and Kong, the six inches. And so in total, I am missing the common Godzilla, Godzilla sleeping, and Scar King on the throne. Just three pops. Unless they're making more, those are the only three I'm missing. For now, that is it for this video. That is our unboxing of the haul. I will do the Funko Pop review video when I get the remaining three so I can finally do a complete review. For now, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel for more. And of course, are you gonna pick up these Funko Pops? Which ones are you getting? Or are you just gonna get all of them? Let me know in the comments for now. I'm going to bed, I'm super tired, so we'll see you in the next video.